with the theme navigating the challenging landscape of veterinary practice in nigeria opportunities and challenges for young veterinarians speakers at the event charge veterinary practitioners to stand tall in integrity impeccable character professional in service be alert on global trends and uphold high ethical and professional standards i want to call the young veterinarians young graduates to 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 put in all the skills that they have learned from the university for them to be able to 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 to, to practice veterinary medicine in nigeria what we help them to uh, make progress in their in their career is to be able to navigate through those challenges I would just encourage them to continue with the high level of training that they have received and they should display that in the process of uh, carrying out their responsibilities to the citizens of this country. As zoonotic diseases continue to pose a threat in Nigeria, these experts encourage veterinarians to ensure the animal and public health services are on alert and the trend is monitored closely. A clear example of multisectoral collaboration rooted in World Health approach. When they step out of this place, they should raise their shoulder eye and make sure that anywhere they find themselves, they prove their worth. Because there is nothing a veterinarian cannot do once it's out of this system. I will advise them to not to lose it, to be focused, to also go all out in making sure that they get all those skills. I know this is not enough. I know veterinary medicine as a profession needs a lot of practice, a lot of upgrading, and so I intend to do that. Some of the very lethal diseases that causes harm to humans have been transmitted from animals to humans. So basically, I would love to go into the public health aspect of veterinary medicine. The occasion saw 62 veterinary doctors inducted into veterinary medicine practice in Nigeria. Ngozi Onyejiako, AIT News, Abuja.